you got a lot of celebrities that are tweeting all kinds of crazy shit. You pulled out a couple of them. What do you, what's on your mind with this? This is nuts. It makes me crazy when people who are worth 50 million or $100 million who live in an estate that's three blocks long tweet, we're all in this together. Uh, I've got a couple examples on that side. You've got Ellen DeGeneres in her $27 million estate that I've seen on television. It is glorious. And she's there with her wife, Portia, saying, oh, it's so horrible. I'm at home. Uh, it's like we're in jail and we're all in this together. Meanwhile, half her crew has been laid off with no money. They can't get survival bucks from the production company. And they're in their little dinky apartment starving while Portia and Ellen are living the good life. You know what else bothers me? Nancy Pelosi. I mean, this is just so out of touch. Takes a video of her in front of her $30,000 refrigerators, opening the door saying, this is how we got through the COVID-19 crisis. And she shows off her gourmet custom ice cream that's filling her freezer. And I think it was like $500 worth of ice cream. This is how rough it is at the Pelosi house. And no, I don't need to go back to Washington. I'm home with my husband eating ice cream. Don't you feel bad? For me. Yet those people up there keep re-electing her and re-electing her and re-electing her. It's unbelievable and you know, to me. And, and you know who had the best comment, Kent, of all people, celebrity-wise? My favorite, I mean, it's hard to believe this, but there's a young lady who became sort of infamous for her goofy stunts in her videos, Miley Cyrus. Yes. And she came out with a tweet and a video saying, I don't know how bad it is for most people. I have money. I have a beautiful home. I have plenty of food. And I don't know how bad you're suffering, but I know it's bad. Miley Cyrus, of all people, wow. is the most empathetic of celebrities who is not dumb enough to say, yeah, we're all suffering together. Yeah. No, 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 you're not. Yeah. And you know what? You know, as goofy as she is, she's got a pretty good touch with reality. I mean, she's around people. She was raised in the sticks. I mean, she's out here in L.A., of course, as a kid. But, you know, she's got her roots back home in Kentucky and a uh, great gal. So I absolutely salute her for that uh, that particular tweet.